we're going to download the Arduino software, install it, and install the drivers, and then test out the uh, test out the board. So let's go to Google, which is where we are now, and get our Arduino software. So let's go to the address bar and key in www.arduino.cc and you come here click on download you come here scroll down to here where it says download click on windows and this window pops up click on OK and there's our file it contains all the Arduino stuff that you need double click it and you come here note it is still this guy is still in a zip file drag this into any folder like so I just dragged it into C Arduino dash dot 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 double click you should see the drivers folder great now we can install the system Take the USB end of your Arduino and plug it into the USB port of your computer. Like so. Now we must install the drivers. That will teach the PC how to talk with the Arduino. Go to my computer right click go to properties we come to the system properties dialog box click on hardware click on device manager you come here to the device manager screen here is our bad boy where it says USB device right click on that guy like so. And select Update Driver. This screen appears. Click here on Install from a list or specific location. Yes, click here. Then click here on Next. You come to this screen. Click on this box, choose Browse, and select the Drivers folder, the Drivers folder, where your Arduino download was installed. OK, let's do it. Choose Browse. And you come to this screen. Here's where my Arduino got installed. I click on that plus guy, and I choose the Drivers folder. I select the Drivers folder. That's it not the guy underneath him not this guy this guy the drivers folder that's our guy click on OK click on next because you come back to the previous screen click on next it's working now oh you get a warning uh, Arduino Uno R3 has not passed Windows logo testing to verify its compatibility, yada, yada, yada. Don't worry. Hit continue anyway, right here. And that's it. You are done. Click on finish. Now, go back and check Device Manager, and you will see something similar to this. It will say Arduino Uno R3 and whatever COM port you're connected to. I'm connected to COM3. So let's test out our board now by uploading a simple program to it. Go to the folder where your Arduino was installed. Scroll down that folder till you see this icon. Double click. This guy pops up. Wow, this is your interface program. Let's send a simple test program to the Arduino to make sure that it works. If the program compiles and uploads without 
any errors showing up in this display window, then that means it works and the driver's installed correctly. We'll upload a basic shell program to the Arduino that has both functions, both required functions, but no code in those functions. If that compiles and uploads, then it all works. It's that simple. The first function is setup. So I can void setup, open close parens, then open close curlies. Then I can the next required function. Void loop, open close parens, open close curlies. That's it. If that compiles and uploads, then it all works. It's that simple. Well, here's our program. Let's test it. I go to the menu, sketch, and verify compile. Well, look over here. It's compiling. Ha <laughs> ha, it worked. Over here, no error messages. Let's upload it now. Upload it where? To the Arduino. How? Go to the menu. Click on File. Click on Upload. Now, it's about to start uploading. It's about to start uploading. Keep watching the red circled area here. Keep watching it and watch what happens. Oh, bingo! Look at the Arduino light up. That means it is uploading the program. And our absence of errors in the black box area here confirms that our program uploaded well. What do you know? Well, that's it. Thanks so much for listening. This is Hoboken Gear. Yeah. So long.